Hi, Virgo. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, so when I was shuffling off camera, I heard I'm tired of waiting. That could be you, Virgo. It could be someone that you're dealing with. I'm tired of waiting. Let's see what's going on here. Get your own personal reading uh, by uh, following, oh, going over to the website. Uh, all the links are in the description box below. Let's see. What is going on for Virgo here? What do we have for Virgo? Okay, the world card. So you could be dealing with a fixed energy, Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo, Taurus, Ace of Swords, tired of waiting. You know, okay, I heard like I'm about to sign in papers. Somebody's like, we're going to either legally separate or divorce altogether. I'm tired of this. This could even be child support or um, spousal support, alimony. Someone is coming at you for money or you come or you having to go at someone else for money. Tired of waiting. Yeah, maybe in regards to a child or you, you're getting some enlightenment. You see what it really is. If somebody's playing with you with the sun card, um, playful, playfulness, they're toying with you, um, pulling your leg, jerking you around. They're not telling you the truth about this money six of pentacles about this loan about this money that they owe you that they're supposed to give you on clockwork you shouldn't have to beg for it you should have to over ask you shouldn't have to do that yeah the queen of pentacles especially if you are a single mother if you're a working mother uh, I mean, it looks like you're good. You know, it's not like you are destitute or anything of that nature. But you shouldn't have to beg or you shouldn't have to ask a million times. It, it should just be known. Uh, this also could be in a relationship. Someone is feeling like I'm, I'm about to cut this off. I'm tired of waiting because this person, you know, has no real uh, expectations to make this a real relationship. Someone is coming into understanding their worth understanding that they're um wasting their time here that they're just getting enough somebody's giving just enough for you to hold on in this relationship Let's see what else advice all right let's see yeah so release the baggage from this relationship the knight of swords and the star card definitely could be dealing with an aquarius aquarius could be significant around this time a friend group or friend or circle of people or online or um, something about technology uh, some understand that somebody's just coming to you for sex looking up to you for sexual activity because she's naked and you have to look up to the star or stars if someone you know comes in with this like whirlwind type of romance um, for sex or they persuade you they use all these words they say these things this is what they're determined to do and then they're out like a light yeah six of swords and then they move on it also says you need to make sense of moving on be rational you know does it make sense to stay in this um again uh releasing the headache of a previous relationship moving on in secrecy in, in secrecy you don't need to make a big public announcement you don't even need to tell your person this could even be weaning yourself off or you know this relationship you know taking calls or sending text messages less and less moving on taking care of your own self and maybe even a child here we got a child showing up in the six of swords um reconciling but this isn't the reconciling that you're thinking of like oh we, we're gonna get back together but recon reconciling um the fact that this person is not changing you know you, you need to reconcile that in your mind in your mind's eye first um, so that you can let something new develop for you go in a new direction some of you have like books or something that you want to write or something that you need to really marry yourself to if you do it each and every day you can see success from this you have like a a, a, a gift a talent that you need to foster you need to get under some mentorship and present yourself to the world but take that heartbreak and that alienation and that isolation and that divorce and not getting what you want and turn it into something big something monumental uh, turn that trauma into wow turn it into um, something beautiful something that you built from the, the ground up maybe even a guidance book or like self-help book 
yep, self help book coming out, Four of Swords. So the universe is like, you need to just shift with the fool coming out. Shift your focus, your direction, your trajectory. Go after your your goals, your dreams, some relationship, some person who's toying with you. Let it go because they're going to get what they want. Yeah, you need to marry yourself, marriage. This looks like marrying your dreams, marrying something that you're going to, you know, create. You have the gift here. It's like you have a gift and you need to, you have talent, you have a gift. You need to foster it. You need to cultivate it. You need to get into some mentorship. Let it out. This repressed gift because it looks like you're looking everywhere else for fulfillment, for engagement, for fun and you need to really cultivate that within yourself yeah and you've been dealing with maybe chasing somebody or chasing them for money or chasing them to be with you or, or dealing with the drama the pettiness that they give you for maybe two or more years some of you definitely it's about money and spousal support someone not taking care of a child um, and they're a really official person they have the money or maybe they could be acting like they they do when they you know they have the money look um, the wealthy man and the false person, you know, they're acting like they don't. Um, so that's what I have for you, Virgo. If it resonates, let me know what part resonates for you. If we need to roll up on some money, and get this money from, uh, <laughs> let me know, um, how it resonates for you. Uh, if you took something from the reading, get your own personal reading, uh, now at the website level. But before you go to the website, which is below in the description box here on YouTube, click the community tab get yourself a discount code and then head over to the website and then book there. That's my gift to you. So take care. Many blessings to you. Talk soon.